in Oxford for 50 years plus. I hate to admit that, but damn it, it's the way it is. And uh, I think that's more than most of the people that have been here. I heard a comment about age. Um, just with a little respect to your audience or, or your public here, with respect to how you're looking at things, is uh, I don't believe there's anybody here that uh, is under the age of 35 as part of the public, other than probably Rachel or maybe. Okay. Yes, me. Yeah. And I don't know if Kevin probably is too, but I don't consider him part of the public. So. He's <laughs> closer to you guys than he is our guy. Other than that, there isn't. So it is a person that, just like Jeff said, it's not from the body of Oxford. And the only two that I did speak of under 35 that are here are my adult children. And they care enough to be here to listen to what's going on, which uh, apparently there isn't a whole lot of others in the village or the town or anywhere else that do. Um, I won't go into names, but I, on the credibility thing again for people, I just have one last thing I want to read. It's an email. <laughs> And it actually is an email to me that I think is quite relevant. It's his response to um, to a statement at the last town board meeting. And I received this that says, I'm crunched with a writing deadline today. As soon as I have time, I will check the village legal papers. If you are right about the prospective defendants, I will issue a correction. Thanks for always greeting me with a smile and helping me keep my facts straight. That was what was sent to me. I'll read you. And actually, that also went to Jim Hemstraw and Ken Ryan on the, uh, the planning board. Or actually, the uh, planning board and the uh, um, town board. My reply. Not the same thing as getting it right the first time, but you know that. Just think how much more fair it would be for those actually seeking the truth if the truth was what you all are selling. Of course, if you were getting it right, you would not have much to say, would you? And I think that kind of sums it up. Thank you very much.